Season 11 of Vanderpump Rules already has emotions running high as the cast navigates life from business endeavors to rocky relationships. There's still a lot of love laughs and drama to come, but is forgiveness in the cards? Take a look. I want to apologize to you for the way I acted last year during your divorce. I know that you were going through a lot. But you're apologizing, that's great, but for me, like, apologies are just, like, words. It's fathomless, really, to carry on in an affair like that. Fathomless? Yeah. Like, 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 wow, like, you can't even fathom that happening? No, because you know what I did? I walked away from a 12-year marriage when I still, like, loved the person I still had just because I wanted to be happy. I didn't start behind this bed. Not the same people. Obviously. And Vanderbilt Rules star Katie Maloney is with me now. Welcome. Thank you for having me. Oh, we're so happy you're here. We want to get all the juicy things. I mean, I wanted to keep watching that scene. We haven't <laughs> seen it. We just saw you, or at least Sandoval, apologize to you. Do you ever see that relationship evolving? I I don't know. I don't I don't think so. I will. I think my life is is pretty good without him. <laughs> yeah, I, th I think you pretty much stick to that every time we see you talk about it. Mm -hmm. uh, you really have Ariana's back. Do you think that this season helped strengthen your friendship even more? Oh my gosh, definitely. I think we, you know, we're starting a business together, but also, you know, we've we've been through a lot of the similar or same things, so we have that in common, and I think that just bonded us. Have you been able to see her in Chicago yet? I went last night. Whoa, and tell I, us about it. I cried. She was so good. She's so talented, and she works really hard. And she's really nice to people. I know I had friends go recently to see her in it, and when she came out, she took a picture with my friend's daughter, like took time to say hello to everybody. So it's always nice to see that people deliver, not just on stage, but off too. Oh, yeah, definitely. So you and Lala have some friction this season, and you guys are two of the strongest personalities on the show. What is it like when that happens? Uh, I mean, in the moment, it's it's not fun. We definitely have the same arguing style, I'll say. So we don't back down, and it's just it's fighting fire with fire, and it's not fun to watch it either. Yeah, I, I mean, I'm assuming you guys have made up since then, and then having to see it. Yeah. Or maybe not. <laughs> you'll, you'll see. <laughs> All right. Well, Sheena has been sharing her thoughts as she navigates Scandal this season. Have any of her comments surprised you watching them back? Yes and no, but mostly no. <laughs> really? Yeah. I mean, I think Sheena is, is naturally just is very torn. You know, she wants, you know, the people pleaser in her really wants to keep things copacetic and she wants to like be friends with everyone and that's really difficult to do in these times so mm -hmm. well in the preview for the rest of the season it looks like Schwartz is trying to reconnect with you what were your initial thoughts on that I mean you saw it on my face I was just <laughs> like oh no no, no. <laughs> oh Schwartzy uh, <laughs> I know you're like oh Schwartzy well you just filmed the reunion this weekend and they released the seating chart how important is the seating chart with this cast uh, with us, I don't, I don't know that we think about it as much. Sheena, just because she has her good side, the <laughs> shoe boy, so she always wants to know. But I think, I feel like fans uh, get more of a kick out of it than we do. I mean, I, I think I just want to know mostly for like what I'm wearing. That's, I think that's the only reason why it would matter. What, or can you give us a hint? What color? What are you wearing? It's silver. Silver. Okay, we're going to go sparkly. Now, let's talk about the bombshells that are usually dropped at the reunion. Do we have a lot to look forward to? Is there any that you could share with us? Um, it's emotional. There was a lot of tears. Any that surprised you? Oh, yeah. You'll... <laughs> I, I had a lot of surprise faces. Oh, we have surprise faces. We like those. All right, yeah. well, Andy Cohen said <laughs> the second half of the season really takes off. Do you agree? What can you tell us? I, I agree. Um, it gets fun and, and a little scandalous, yeah. All right, and you felt that way while you were filming. It just really took off. I think, yeah, definitely. Oh, All my right. gosh, there's some heated arguments and some, you know, flings that happen and it's fun yeah and the valley premieres tonight mm -hmm. on peacock will you be watching your friends um i don't know if I'll, at some point maybe tonight i'll catch some clips but you know sure <laughs> all right Brittany and Jax. well thank you so much you also started a podcast that, you know that we can it's called disrespectfully we mm -hmm. should tune into that as well how are you liking this one oh i'm having so much fun with it um my 
friend Dana, she's one of my best friends. We just want to create this community where we're just authentically, unapologetically ourselves, discussing what it's like to you know be single, dating, embracing all the things. Thank you. We need that. Yeah. We appreciate it. Well, we always appreciate you, Katie. You can catch Vanderpump Rules Tuesdays at 8 p.m. on Bravo and streaming the next day on Peacock. Thanks so much for coming in. Thank you.